Namaste friends, we are continuing the yoga series. Let's talk about the Gajakesari Yoga. It is um, a very very famous yoga uh, besides Raja Yoga. This Gajakesari, uh, the benefit that it yields if you have one is you'll have many friends and relations around you. You would be polite and generous and they say you would be a somewhat of a huge property tycoon where you, you build uh, townships and all that. It's also said that you'll have lo long life and uh, and a lasting reputation, right? Even after you have passed on, after you have died, your name would linger on. Okay, it is is to be said. This Gajakeshi is so powerful that uh, once uh, it's seen in the charts, a, a celebration is also done to to thank the gods for having such a boon uh, in one's charts. So how do you know if you have Gajakeshri? It's very simple. You have to look at the um, Kendra houses uh, from the moon, not from your Lagna, not from your uh, natal Lagna, but from your moon, the first, uh, so the, the first will be the moon, and the fourth from the moon, the seventh from the moon, the tenth from the moon. Okay, all the angles, all the kendras from the moon, and if you have Jupiter in any of those houses, then a Gajakeshri is formed. Of course, yogas are very, very complicated thing. This is for advanced students actually. Uh, we need to assess individually, right? Uh, what dasa is going through, uh, the house that uh, the kendra or the Jupiter is residing. Uh, what is that house? Is that an enemy to that Jupiter or uh, is it con conjunction with another planet? Uh, if that planet is in the Nietzsche Banga, uh, you know, there's so many things to look at it. Uh, the the strength of the planets and all that. It, we, we cannot simply uh, arbitrarily say that, hey, I have um, the Jupiter in the 1, 4, 7, 10 from my moon, so I have the Gajakeshri. You are not precisely correct, okay? So we really need to assess uh, individually to see uh, what are the points that one would uh, get if uh, one, one has the Gajakeshari. But you may, they say, even if you don't do any assessment, you may not build a township. Perhaps you might build a few houses, you know. Still, Gajakeshari is very powerful and you are truly gifted if you have one. Okay, friends? So please stay tuned for more yogas, uh, uh, part of this yoga series. Uh, I hope to cover as many as possible. As you know, the, the permutations are uh, there is endless. But I'll try to cover a few hundred. And uh, until the next time, thank you. Namaste.